Solar power is helping schools across the nation cut costs and pay teachers more. As of 2020, 7,332 schools nationwide have installed solar power, 5.5% of the nation's K-12 private and public schools. This means that more than 5.3 million students go to a school with solar power. And as of 2020, solar schools have 1,365 megawatts of total installed capacity, which is enough to power 254,030 U.S. homes. Much of this growth has happened in California, where 45% of the solar school capacity exists. California is one of 28 states, plus DC, that have approved power purchase agreements for schools. This allows a third party, typically a developer, to pay for installation and maintenance of the panels. The school then buys that solar power, usually at lower rates than buying from a utility company. Generation 180, which released the 2020 report on solar schools, said that there are many incentives for schools to install. Energy is the second largest expense for US schools at $8 billion per year. So producing solar would save money in a major way for the school districts. The Batesville School District in Arkansas installed 759 kilowatts of solar and upgraded to be more energy efficient. They've seen nearly $300,000 per year in savings and expect savings of at least $2.4 million over 20 years. A portion of the money saved has been put into teachers' salaries. Outside of economical interests, students are exposed to technology in a real-world way, and some even get job training. The nature of solar also allows for backup power if the grid experiences outages, and schools can easily be turned into emergency shelters during natural disasters. 